scanning for audio. Hello and welcome to a Tin Dog podcast. This time talking about, well, it's Doctor Who. It's the 10th Doctor, Classic Companions. Now, there are three stories in this box set because that's what you do when you get the 10th Doctor. You get three stories. However, arguably, this isn't the 10th Doctor box set. What this is, my friends, is it's the K9 box set. Oh yeah, the K9 box set. K9 appears in all three stories. I'm excited because it's the 10th Doctor and K9. Right, I'll just pop him back over here. What we've got is three great stories. I mean, when I say great stories, I mean these are the stories that you actually want to own. Not just because they're the 10th Doctor, which you'll want to do anyway. No, you'll want to own these because they are just crackingly good. Seriously, you've got Splinters by John Dorney. The Doctor finds K-9 floating in space and sets off to clear up a Time War fallout. First they find Leela protecting a village from a Spriggan. More in a minute. Number two is the stuntman, Lizzie Hopley. Lizzie's been doing some brilliant work, right? The Doctor and K-9 enter a virtual world of a movie stuntman to help Nyssa escape from a Time War criminal scheme. Nyssa! Quantum of Axos, great title, by Roy Gill. Ace, yeah, no. Ace investigates a new technology company which seems too good to be true and meets the Doctor in K9 as Axos escapes a trap. Well, its trap, yeah. The Tenth Doctor revisits his companions K9, Leela, Ace and Nyssa long after the time-travelling adventures had finished because they all need help. When people need help, the Doctor will not refuse. Which is almost what's written here. So, is it good? Oh my god, it's great. But that's not what you're here for. You're here for some big, in-depth me taking stuff apart and rebuilding it and going, mm, yes, narrative structure, marvellous. Well, you know what? It's just great. Seriously. I mean, okay, I'm going to freak out. It's got K9. There's a K9 in the 10th Doctor box set. Yeah. However, in episode two, you're sitting there going, oh, have they got John Leeson playing another part? Because that's John Leeson's voice. I know that voice anywhere. Because he's such a great actor. And it is. And you know what? It works. It works on a great, brilliant level. Yes, there's spoilers involved, which I'm not going to go into. You know I don't do that. That's not this sort of podcast slash vlog, whatever you want to call it. I just loved this box set. The Tenth Doctor is great. I mean, let's face it, in the extras you've got recordings where the director's going, well, we sat down, we recorded it, he got it in one, so we did it again, just for safety. It's lovely, absolutely lovely, that the Tenth Doctor is doing his grand tour and we got all these box sets. Now, this is arguably, apparently, the last one for a while because you know David's now got work on because there isn't a lockdown it's the thing that I'm actually grateful for Covid for because we got these box sets that we wouldn't have got brilliant quality superbly crafted and as far as I'm concerned well I just want more old companions because I am nostalgia man this is proof that Audio Doctor Who has categorically been better than TV Doctor Who for me for years. And if ever you needed proof, get this. You know you want to. So until next time, be seeing you. From Big Finish Productions, Doctor Who, 10th Doctor, Classic Companions. Once upon a time, that is how stories begin. But have you ever stopped to wonder what that means? K9! Yes! The whistle still works! Just like riding a bike. Standby mode, deactivating. Leela, what have you done? Stopped you making a mistake, Peter Kelly. This is not the one we hunt. 
Leela, it's you! Floor 12, enjoy your visit to a charitable Earth. Do my best. Miss McShane, you're back! That jump was incredible! Hearts are still bumping. Thank you, Doctor. And that car roll this morning. Oh, oh, good luck! Uh, First she's ever done. One take. You're the Doctor! Yes, Nissa! I remember! No! We're out of road! You've got a new face. Again. And you're still not Scottish. Are you sure about that, lassie? I can do Scottish. I'm totally <laughs> Scottish. <laughs> Exos expansion triggered. Actualize. You need to disconnect that thing. Thing, inanimate object, distinct from sentient beings. Don't listen to him, canine. Ugh, you have some seriously twisted ideas about filing. Make this thing let me go. Worlds, worlds of plenty, boundless nutrition. Big finish for the love of stories.